Hey guys, so I just came home from Target. It is super late at night, but it's the day before Halloween and I wanted to show what I got. This was literally some of the only things that was left. Target was picked clean. I couldn't wait to go to the Halloween section. I was late this year. I managed to go to Home Depot. So I managed to go to some other Halloween stuff. But Target, I hadn't gotten to. Our Target's escalator was broken, so I didn't go upstairs. <laughs> And I was, so it was broken like, for like all the whole month. And I just say for like going upstairs and letting everything downstairs. And I was like, okay, I'm gonna finally see the Halloween stuff. And nothing was, I mean, the shelves were clean. Only thing I could manage to get for you guys was this. It's called Hide and Eek Hot Drink Bombs. And it's filled with mini marshmallow, strawberry flavored white chocolate brains. So what's more fun than eating brains for Halloween? I'm sorry if I look kind of tired. I am exhausted. I really am. I'm super tired. It's the day before. It's, it's October 30th. And I want to do stuff for Halloween. So I'm going to be editing these videos up um getting them up to y'all guys got a new ice field coming and i want to get everything done tonight so i'm just trying to get it done and um yeah so i got some oat milk so i'm hoping it still works with oat milk i didn't have any regular white milk and i didn't want it's like hot water so i got it says use it says on the back heat three fourths cup of milk very warm Drop one drink bomb into the cup, let the bomb dissolve, stir as needed, watch for the marshmallow explosions. I hope that it still works with oat milk. It might not, but we shall see. I didn't want to use like hot water or anything. I didn't have any regular milk, so that's so what we got. I had goat milk, so I didn't want to use goat milk. <laughs> so let's open this guy up. When I tell you it was clean, I should have took pictures. It was clean. There was nothing left. They look kind of, they look really, really cool. They smell good. It smells like strawberries. I've been kind of on a strawberry kick lately. They look really good. You can hear it. Can y'all hear it? That's fun. You can hear all the little marshmallow -y explosions inside. I tell you guys, every time I do something like this, I never have regular milk. Like, I'll have regular milk every day, but not when I need actual milk. <laughs> They look kind of like brains. They look actually a lot like brains. <laughs> all right, now after all my talking, I probably let my milk cool off, so I might have to reheat it, but let's drop it in and see what happens. Drop the brain in the milk. Ah, I think I let it cool off. <laughs> okay, wait a second, it's still, it's still melting, nice. One of will turn pink. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm sure y'all can see it, but I'm gonna pull the camera down a little so you can see the all nice more nice, nice marshmallows. You see the little marshmallows? It didn't really explode, but I think it's a little cute. <laughs> Alright, so let's give it a smell. You can see it's all crisscross. I kinda like that though. I think anybody who's doing a little Halloween party would love seeing little swirls in the cup. It makes it feel like it's all brain like. It smells good. You can smell the strawberries too. Let's give it a drink. It's nice. It get a nice little smooth flavor. Hmm. It's pleasant. It doesn't. It's not super sweet at all. It gives it a little mild sweetness. I think it would be better in regular whole milk. But in the oat milk, it's like almost like an oatmeal type of uh, taste because it's like made with oats. It's not bad. It's not chocolatey, of course. You can taste the strawberry. The marshmallows are cute and small. It's nice. It was more fun to make than to actually drink. It's not bad. <laughs> it actually sweetened it better than I expected. I didn't think it was going to sweeten it at all, but it actually did. Just one sweetened it enough you know i would actually i want to i kind of want to be bad i'm not going to do it tonight but i would probably put two brains in the cup 
Because I think two would probably like really enhance it, but like, I don't know. Let me see my sugars in this. So one drink bomb has 15 sugars, quite a bit. 15 sugars. Yeah, one protein, 20 sodium, not bad sodium wise, not at all. And 130 calories. Wow, that's a lot for one little brain. One brain? 130 calories for one brain. So I would just probably just do one. I just got a big sweet tooth, I guess. No, I really don't. But like, because of my drinks, I like my drinks kind of sweet. So, but not bad. <laughs> so yes, I would still recommend it. I think it'd be really, really fun for a Halloween sleepover or party. Just drop a little fun brain in your cup. I think that'd be a lot of fun. And uh, yeah, so if you want to buy it, you probably have to buy it online. Because if your target is like my target, is empty. There's nothing left. <laughs> but you might can get it. And I don't even know if it's going to sell or not. But I just want to check it out. It's a lot of fun. It's cute. And I think it makes for a really fun party favor. So basically it, guys. Tell me in the comments if y'all have tried little party bombs or drink bombs before. Do they flavor the drink enough for y'all? And if you have, so which one's your favorite? Chocolate? It's my first white chocolate one. So it's, it was different. I think it's the white chocolate one a little more sweeter, which is pretty cool. So y'all tell me in the comments if y'all have ever tried it. And what would y'all have done? Would y'all have bought the eyeball one or the brain one? Because next time maybe I'll get the eyeball one if it's on sale when I go back. I doubt it. I think everything's going to be gone. And it'll be like Christmas up. <laughs> so, <laughs> you know what? This is the first year where I went upstairs and it wasn't like a, it was not a whole bunch of Christmas stuff. It was just empty shelves. It was just like, it was no Halloween stuff and like not much Christmas either, which is really shocking. Weird. So, I'll talk to you guys later and I want to say happy Halloween. Hope you all enjoy Halloween. And, uh, yeah, I hopefully I will too. I don't know what I want to be today if I want to even dress up. Not sure. Tell me the comments what y'all costumes will be. That'd be fun. So, okay, guys. Bye. <laughs>